Rise and shine, it's photo making time. Well, hello there, handsome. Another day here in Buenos Aires. Today I'm heading to the most colorful neighborhood in the entire city. We're going to La Boca. It's another perfectly beautiful day here in Buenos Aires. Though I've been complaining a little bit about being bored with the domestic life, I cannot complain about the weather. It's just been perfect here. I've taken the metro, well, two different metros actually, over to Constitución Station, and now I'm walking like 25 minutes to a part of La Boca called Caminito. In so many ways, Buenos Aires isn't one city, but like 10 different cities rolled into one. You have San Telmo, you have Palermo, you have Almargo where I'm staying. And much like in New York City where you have Queens, Brooklyn, Harlem, Lower Manhattan, they're all their own boroughs that have their own like distinct feeling and they're really uniquely different to one another. La Boca, there's lots of graffiti, there's a lot of street art, and the Caminito where we're going is like the most touristy part of the entire city. So let's head that way. It is a Caminito. Unlike a lot of the places I've been here in Buenos Aires or I'm returning to in Buenos Aires that I didn't photograph well the last time, I photographed this really well last time. In fact, a shot I took just up here the last time I was here was in Condé Nast in October. And one of my best selling stock images of all time was also shot here. So I'm gonna show you guys those images right now and wander a little bit. that the weather's nice the weather's actually way too nice way too nice it's just bright blue skies and it's kind of been like that every time I go out and shoot photos here in Buenos Aires I get bright blue skies if I'm hanging out at home or up on the rooftop it's like perfect clouds and beautiful skies. so a little bit of bad luck and uh, to get photos from a photo perspective I kind of think I just have to sit and hang out and wait for the light or this cat come here the cat didn't want to be on camera just wanted to ruin the shot Tourists are all starting to leave, the lights coming down, there's even some clouds popping up. So I'm gonna get out my big camera, I'm gonna get out the 6D and shoot some photography and hopefully get some cool shots of here in La Boca El Caminito. Also, what the hell is this thing? I 
I may have jinxed myself a little bit when I said I thought the clouds were coming. They seem to have disappeared again. I just did an Instagram live and the question everybody was asking was safety. And a lot of people were like, be careful with your gear there, bro, be careful. And I'll tell you this, when I was here two years ago, there was no police and I was out here shooting until like 10 p.m. Or, or maybe 9 p.m. and I had no issue at all. That being said, this isn't meant to be the safest spot in town. Now, right now there's like two police officers behind me. There's two police officers over there. I just talked to them and they said they're here until 10 p.m. So no stress about that. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine, guys. A lot of times when I go out shooting, I know exactly if I got good images or not before I get home and get them on the computer. Today I have no idea, no clue. The light was so-so, average-ish, um, and these street lights are really harsh and they're creating all sorts of like flaring and it was a bit of a challenge. But a cool spot and a big thanks to the police officers that are hanging out here because they're looking after the place. Um, I'm gonna jump in a taxi now and head home. Hey, I'm home, sweet home. I had like this thought that I was gonna talk about something when I got back, but I really have no idea what I was gonna talk about. So I guess I'm calling this an episode. It was really, really good to get out and photograph La Boca again. Let's talk about rights really quick since I just thought about this. La I mentioned that I sold a couple of these images from last time I was in La Boca. One of the images went to Condé Nast and that was actually an exclusive sale, meaning that I can't sell that image again for two years. So going back to the same place again, even though I got good photos last time is important because I got different images this time that I can sell again. Again, especially since some of those images sold exclusively last time which was awesome and if I sell any of these images tonight I'll be stoked about it um, guys I'm calling it an episode I guess I'll see you tomorrow I think I'm gonna do an episode tomorrow but no guarantees here in Buenos Aires because some days are just way too boring of me on my computer getting caught up on office work for me to film so we'll see if there's a vlog tomorrow I hope so and I hope to see you there peace